From the grocery store aisle to the family farm, Alaska, of all places, has become the go-to destination for new small farms. But that rise is sowing controversy. In tonight's Eye on America, CBS's Jonathan Vigliotti takes a look at the farming boom in America's last frontier. Alaska's northern lights are the color of opportunity. And in the state's pristine interior, there's a new road for people to bet on. So we're traveling right now with the Division of Agriculture through what is Alaska's boreal forest. And if all goes according to their plan, this will be turned into farmland. The boreal forest is one of the largest trappers of carbon dioxide on Earth. But as Alaska warms twice as fast as the rest of the country, once frozen land is now thawed out and up for grabs. I see climate change in Alaska as an opportunity to, to bring in more crops, to develop more land. Eric Johnson oversees the Nanana Agriculture Project, which in October began auctioning off 140,000 acres of the forest, divided into parcels, to the highest bidders from all over the world. Couldn't there be anywhere else that you could look to develop land for farming and not here? This is the most suitable land for agriculture development. This is only 140,000 acres. But statewide, the rush for land is on. The number of farms here have grown 44%, making Alaska the state with the most amount of new farms in the country. Native tribes who live off the land in the boreal forest worry the project will be abused and cause pollution. What did this land mean to you? This is our grocery store. This is how we grew up learning how to live off of this land. The state says bidders are required to submit development plans, but acknowledges they're not strict. We want real farmers. We want to provide opportunities. We can't tell them exactly how to, to use that opportunity. I see the lower 48 as getting hotter and drier, and we've got a lot of water and we've got a lot of clean land. It's a new gamble for Alaska. Is the last frontier the new frontier for farming in America? I believe it is. A risk not everyone is willing to take. Agriculture is probably something we need to get into, but what does it look like? It doesn't look like this. For Ion America, I'm Jonathan Vigliotti in Alaska's Boreal Forest.